Sikora, Czech Republic, Tayu, United States, Shrada, silver medalist in Moscow, Mikan of Belarus, Kazmarek, second here last year, and Caroli on the outside for Italy, all contesting this first event. Mikan gets away well in lane four with Shrada just inside him. Tayu trying to get on terms in lane two, but it's Mikan from Shrada. Kazmarek will be third, but Mikan takes it. A new lifetime best for the Belarusian. Shrada in second, Kazmarek third. On to the long jump. South African Willem Kurtzen. 10.99 in the 100. 7.46, that's OK. Kazmarek, 10.78 in the 100 metres. That's another one, just over 7.5 metres. He's delighted with that. Schrader, fourth after the 100. And he's up to third with that. He's delighted, 7.66. Good work from the German. Kazmarek, sixth in the world indoors last year. Might slip down the leaderboard with that one. Schrader, he'll be expecting bigger than his compatriot. Well over 14 metres. Now Bastien Ozil, a great putter at his best. Wow, that's close to 16 metres. He moves up to fifth overall with that put. Kurtzen for 2.03. Just inside the top 10 in Moscow and in London. That's good from the South African. No wonder he's smiling. Kazmarek, this for 2.09. Oh, yes. He's up to second overall. That's why he's leaping with joy. Tayu, the American, has a lifetime best of 2.17. And he's made 2.15 look very easy there, like he's got springs on his heels. Damien Warner in the long tights is coming away here. Kazmarek's in second. Warner, a little bit of pride restored here. He had a no mark in the shot put, so he's way down the rankings. He takes the 400. Kazmarek's second in this one, but that means he's the overnight leader. Kai Kazmarek. The overnight leader, he starts on the right of picture, but he's got away pretty slowly here, unlike Damien Warner. Warner was brilliant in the 400 metres last night. Remember, he had that no mark in one of the throws, so he's way down the leaderboard. Warner absolutely annihilates that 110 hurdles. A little indication of what might have been. Kazmarek had his lead eroded in that one. Kazmarek wants to finish in the top five in Beijing, he says, at the World Championship. He's definitely lost the lead now. Schrada lying in fourth coming into this one, and he's still there or thereabouts with 42-11. Kurtzen, sixth place coming into this discus. Oh, that's a lifetime best. The South African's still in touch. Keisuke Ushiro. Brilliant discus thrower at his best, and that's massive. He moves up well inside the top 20 with that little wave for the camera. Willem Kurtzen on the left-hand runway for 460. Yes. Little pump of the fists. Schrader, five metres on the nose. That is a brilliant clearance from the German. Kazmarek. This for 5.10. Wants to close in again on the leaderboard. Delighted with that. He should finish back up to second at the end of the pole vault. Pietron Vils of Belgium. 5.30. That's massive and a new lifetime best. Schrader. In fourth place coming into this javelin. Would love to finish on the podium. It's been a good competition for the German. He's up to third. Kazmarek edging closer and closer once more to the top of the leaderboard. Coming into this in second, a lifetime best. He's in the lead. 
Kurtzen. What can the South African do here to get himself back in touch with the top three? Oh, that's good. He's got a chance. So it all comes down to the gruelling 1,500 metres. What a run this has been in the distinctive vest for Jeremy Tayu. He's going to be very close to 4.20. Great run from the American. Kurtz in second, Schrader in third. But I don't think they've done enough to stop Kai Kazmarek taking the overall title. There's confirmation Tayu with a new PB beating 4.20. But Kazmarek has taken this one just nine points shy of his lifetime best. That is the best performance in the decathlon this year. High fives all round for the German. 8,462 points. Schrader in second place. And Kurtzen climbed up to third with a lifetime best score. A superb competition here in Galsis.